I Magnus bestest. We got a signal. Let's go quickly enter the trade on pocket option. Let me find a pair. Gu now the expiration. Let's go. Let's go quickly. Ten minutes. Ten. Okay. Up. Okay. We are in. Now the chart time frame. Very nice. Looking good. Okay. So my indicator alerted me on this beautiful signal. Again, I have it once per minute so that's why i hear it more times but uh you know you need to if you don't want to be bothered just put it once per bar so once per candle it will be just once now i have it uh, i have it uh, let me just check all the time for this so that you can see everything how it develops this is actually great learning procedure for you guys especially if you are beginners you see how it goes now down look we need to get on those get in on those retraces and continuing very nice another position <clears throat> another signal so basically in 10 minutes i will hear it 10 times because i have it once per minute but you, as i said you can do it like once per bar or also of course like don't forget um the extension i showed you for chrome for chrome and actually also firefox and brave you can do the you can also use it also for brave the chrome extension and then they're separate for firefox up so basically what i what it does is it lowers you can lower the volume on specific tabs of your browser how cool is that so you don't need to hear uh, the alert such so uh, so loud okay look up we have nice retrace we still can do this like dollar cross averaging because uh, we are this breakout is still confirmed this is just a small retrace as you can see now it is still bullish action even if you see it if you watch it on the lower time frames you understand how the price moves you understand this is bullish you know you have one leg second leg now beginning the third you know and as i said many times you need at least every move mostly has like three good legs this is actually a good lesson guys for you as well looking good we just need to wait a little bit more than you are used to watch me trading five second charts this is a different experience and don't worry guys i will also start again posting uh my trading sessions but i just don't have time to trade all right now I, there's like so many stuff around my indicator i want you to have the best experience i need to also teach you some basics for forex i'm putting up some materials so you know it takes a lot of time also even i don't know like many things i don't even remember now but there's just a lot of things around launching an indicator to make um, all the process around it as smooth as possible i just love watching all these lower time frames how the price develops 
very useful to you know understand everything nice structures very good looking good guys we still have a lot of minutes to go mm, approaching like the middle of the time time frame so looking good looking good nice no stress so for you guys who are a little bit concerned with like quick five second trading i think this is completely completely for you very slow nice and easy to just understand everything here and then maybe slower you will be able to trade even fast charts just take your time guys you don't need to rush trading trading is really just about like everything else you need to get accustomed to the basics and then in trading you need to master not only my strategy but also your psychology but that comes that comes only after you get used to trading on a, like normal slower pace so that the basics are no problem anymore it's like when you want to learn to drive a car you, know, you need to be able to switch the gears automatically and then once you do that you you can start to notice the the streets and everything around your car uh, more efficiently okay let's go we are and actually at this point guys you should not be of course putting any more positions because if you are if you'd be still in drawdown it would me it c could mean that the signal was that you had a bad signal to trade also with my of course with my indicator it doesn't happen normally let's go nice so basically uh, we only get like uh, get in on more positions only when it only at the beginning as you can see it dropping on lower time frames in the i mean if we are bullish and you see it dropping below the breakout level then you can take the advantage of this especially for forex this is a huge advantage because you dollar cost average your entry price you know so you will have a lot more profits let's go nice structures can go even lower but don't get scared this is normal still we just tested the red line and these structures this order block here the okay this this could be a little bit worrying for somebody but don't worry guys this shouldn't we are testing now the this or block all good and the blue line you see how it jumped nice jumped very nicely okay and that was actually news it was not news it was new york uh, stock exchange open nysc so 
actually be careful around these times oh, but it should be all good if the structures are okay now everything in profit first position already secured profit let's go let's go let's go looking good okay so just a few more minutes guys and that's it let me show you the lower time frames so now we did have a very nice v reverse that's always good to see because it actually broke this um, bearish structure on the lower time frames so it means it's a bullish price action okay this one was lost no problem guys and we got in the retrace this one is a win so we are winning we are in profit now ending one profit as well and as you can see we are all well above we are well above our entry prices so looking good guys this is what we like big distance from my from our entries still a few seconds to go there you have it and let's go two more trade 12 seconds for the next one stay above it's moving fast because it's the market opened for the stock nice okay and now just one more let's go okay there you have it guys beautiful trading session so it uh, had a quick retrace just because of the of the market conditions open of the session but very beautiful in the end no problem one loss that's all good so uh nice wins this is how we do it guys it got into this level and then I just and here so beautiful trade actually this would be just for scalpers because uh, there was uh, news coming in so you should never be risking too much on forex take profit uh, even less than one to one you, you would just scalp some profits and just basically that would be it because news as you should know as a forex trader they are very volatile and in this case it was a market open stock market open that's it thanks for watching and have a nice day